Hello traders, this is Hugh. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to download additional historical data. Now your charts already have some historical data, but there are two reasons why you may want to download some additional data. First of all, if you go to the longer term charts, like the monthly charts, you might want to see more monthly data. So for example, this one goes back to 2002. So if there's any data that predates that, you want to download that also. In addition, if you're doing backtesting, automated backtesting in uh, MetaTrader, then you want to go as far back as possible most of the time. So you can also get the data to do that. So how do we do it? First of all, let's go to Tools, and we'll go to History Center, and then find the pair that you want to download the data for. For example, in this case, we're looking for the US Swiss franc. So right here, just double click on that. And as you can see, the monthly time period um, is colored. So that's where uh, we have generated some tick data already. So double click on that. And as you can see, there, there is uh, 100, 145 records. And every time you double click on these other time periods, MetaTrader will think for a second, and then it'll it'll generate the uh, ticks based on the previous time period or the larger time period that it has the data for. So let's download the data for the US dollar Swiss franc, and it's gonna give you a little warning. Don't worry about that. You just have to realize that this data is specific to a certain broker, and if you use another broker, then your results may be different. So click OK and it'll start downloading the data. Okay, so once the data has finished downloading, you will now see a lot more records in your database. So for example, if we double click monthly, there are 522 records where there were only about 140 records before. Um, and I'll show you what that looks like on the chart in a minute, but let's go through the screen really quickly. First of all, each of these lines is a tick in your database, so uh, or a, a bar, excuse me. So, for example, we can change the data here just by clicking on edit. You can change the date, the volume, the high, low, close, and the open. And this is for testing purposes. This is um, so that you can change data that might be bad. Um, or if you need to insert your own data, maybe there's some missing data from your broker, you can click on the add button and you can even delete some of these bars. Uh, you can import your own data and you can export this data to a file so that you can use it with another program or put it into Excel or something like that. Okay, so when you close this window, you will now see that the week, the monthly chart goes all the way back to January of 1989. So it's a lot more data for you to work with and it's a lot better for back testing and figuring out your historical uh, support and resistance points. So I hope that helped, and for more MetaTrader tutorials, visit TradingHeroes.com. Thanks for watching.